Hello. 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 How are you today? Hi. Fine. Great. Did you practice your exercises on the platform? Yes. Okay. And the rest of you, did you have any problems with the platform? Um, no. Okay, so hubo un problema con un ejercicio, pero se resolvió, ¿verdad? El de las casas. Sí, sí. <laughs> okay, bueno, que me alegro. So, nadie ha visto um, lo, la plataforma para hoy. Eh, las, sí, o las profesiones. Uh, mm -hmm. Professions, okay. What professions can you mention? Doctor, yours. Um, pilot, singer, musician, singer, hockey, launcher. Okay. Chef. Any other? Chef, musician, pilot. Sales person. Sales person. Police office. Police officer, yes. Engineer. Security guard, yes. Security, security. Okay. Uh, manager. Manager, okay. Teacher. Teacher, Teacher. okay. Customer service. Customer oh. service. Fly, fly, fly. Es hermosa, pero a fly. Uh, at center, at center. Flight attendant. attendant, flight attendant, okay. Oh, flight attendant. <coughs> hmm? Receptionist. Receptionist. Cashier, 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 okay. Cashier, cashier. cashier. Uh -huh. cashier. Nurse. Nurse, okay. I see that you did your homework, you checked the platform. I can see that. So basically, this is what you saw in the platform, right? Yeah, right. Okay. Uh, okay. The question is, what do you do? What do you do, Iris? Yes. Yes. Uh, uh, yes. No recuerdo qué significaba. ¿Qué es lo que soy? Yes, uh, yes, yes, yes. Your profession, your occupations. Ah, uh -huh. por ahora, uh, mother. <coughs> ah, okay. You are a housewife. <laughs> housewife. Very, very good. Housewife. <laughs> nice, housewife. housewife. Okay, housewife. you work for free. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <I'm on> play. <laughs> And apply those, okay. Enjoy your family then. And Karen, what do you do? A uh, doctor. Oh, you are a doctor. Nice. Is it, uh, well, I think it's a very interesting occupation, right? But it's stressful too. I think, doctor. <laughs> Yeah. Isn't it stressful? No, you like it. Okay. What about you, Antonio? What do you do? I'm sorry, Antonio. Can you repeat? He's an engineer. Okay, you're an engineer. Okay, interesting. What about you, Carla? What do you do? I am a doctor. All right, excellent. Victor, what do you do? Osmin? My profession is uh, business administration. All right, business administrator. That's excellent. Jose, what do you do? Uh, auditor. Oh, you're an auditor. Okay, interesting. Yes. Uh, what about you, Noe? What do you do? Ah, okay. 
Nice. That's interesting. And Jaime, what do you do? Jaime? Your microphone is off. Um, the microphone. Okay, hello. there you go. Yes, hello. What do you do? So I am, I am the electrician. Oh, you're an electrician. Oh, that's nice. And the rest of you, Diego, what do you do? Fatima, what do you do, Fatima? I am communicator and I am designer. Oh, you're a designer. Interesting. Jennifer, what do you do? No sé cómo se dice multimedia. Oh, you, you work on communications? Yes. Oh, all right. Excellent. Uh, Jorge? I, um, I am coordinator of project. Oh, interesting. Adonai, what do you do? Hello, hello. Yes, hello. I'm a police officer. The leader uh, okay. okay, nice. Okay. That's nice. Uh, who's missing? Quien me falta? Me. <laughs> okay. Your name? <laughs> eh, Roxana. What do you do, Roxana? I am a customer service at bank and I have a business. Oh, that's interesting. And the rest of you, who's missing? Who else is missing? Who's missing? Quien falta? What do you do, Victor? Aquí le puede decir a los compañeros. Escríbanos en el chat. I am. Escríbanos en el chat, Victor. What do you do? Yes, Victor. De qué es la dinámica. Ah, so you just have to tell us what's your profession or your occupation. Um, yes, please. I design. Oh, you're a designer. designer. Yes, yes, you're a designer. Okay, interesting. All right. Um, I see that you um you know some vocabulary about professions and occupation. Um, this is on the platform. This is uh, what I'm sharing with you. Is on the platform. So you can see here, and we can practice pronunciation. Let's repeat. Accountant. 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 Bellhop. Bellhop. Cashier. Cashier. Doctor. Doctor. Electrician. Electrician. From desk clerk. From desk clerk. Nurse. Nurse. Office manager. Office manager. Painter. Painter. Plumber. Plumber. Police officer. Police officer. Receptionist. Receptionist. Salesperson. Salesperson. Security guard. Security guard. Taxi driver. Taxi driver. Vendor. Vendor. All right. Do you have any question about the vocabulary here? What is the meaning now? Literal. Accountant. Accountant is contador. Accountant. Accountant. Yes. Vendor. Vendors. Well, vendor is the number three. Um, you can call it like an informal, for like in the street, right? That's vendor. In a well, in a department store or in a mall, they are salesperson. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Salesperson is como digamos formal en una tienda. Um, salesperson. Vendor. Vendor is como esta persona. Es vendedor. Informal. Informal en la calle. Yeah. 
The number 11, uh, what is him? Uh, 11. Let me see. Ah, 11. This one here. 11. This is the bellhop. 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 Uh -huh. It's the person who helps with the luggage in the hotel. Any other question about the vocabulary here? And plumber? Plumber. Plumero. Plumero. Uh, yeah, yeah. It's the number four. Okay. Uh -huh. Plumber. Okay, any other question about vocabulary here? No. Okay, I have a presentation to share with you. Maybe you can find new vocabulary here. Okay. Um, well, we're sorry about that, Victor, your audio problems. All right. What I want to share with you is this presentation is uh, like a game, right? Um, you have to guess. You will read the description with the activities that the person do, right? And you read the description, and in 30 seconds, you have to call out the profession, right? Tienen que decir la profesión en menos de 30 segundos. Lean la descripción rapidito y si la sabe, la dice. No la canta, la dice. Ok. Ok. Time. Hurry. Help people to be healthy. He is a nurse. Doctor. Doctor, yeah. You see. <laughs> Antesito, segundos antes de la campana. Yes, he's a doctor. Talk, talk. Okay. Yes. Nurse. 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 All right. It's a nurse. nurse. <laughs> okay. She provides nurse. patient care and carries out doctor's orders. She is a nurse. Great. Next. Next. Great. Hurry up! I don't know how do you say it. She's a dentist. Uh, <laughs> dentist. Oh, dentist. dentist. Yes, dentist. Dentist. Hey, what happened here? Alguien tocó ahí, verdad? <laughs> Let's continue. Ready? Okay. Veterinary. Veterinary. Yes, exactly. Veterinarian. Yes, that's it. Exactly. Yes, that's it. Okay. Ready? Check the next one. Check the next one. She is teacher. 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 the teacher. <laughs> teacher floor. <laughs> okay. Thank you. All right. Let's continue. Mm, I don't know. Science. Oh. <laughs> science. Scientist. Scientist. Yeah, scientist. Ah, scientist. 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 Mm -hmm. Scientist. Let's continue. Uh, design. Engineer. Uh, engineer. 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 Architect. Architect. Yes. Yes. Architect. You did it. You did it. All right. Let's continue. Let's continue. Let's continue. Architect. Singer. A lawyer. Yes. It's a lawyer. You did it. Lawyer. 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 Yes. Lawyer. 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 Lawy
He designed <laughs> software <laughs> programs. He's a computer programmer. Computer programmer. Uh -huh. I will send you this. Okay. Se las voy a enviar. Let's continue. Okay. He's a plumber. A plumber. Plumber. Yeah. plumber. Yes, he's a plumber. Yes, he did it. Good job. Right. Electric. 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 Electrician. Electrician. That's it. Excellent. Electrician. 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 Waiter. Waiter. Yes, waiter. 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 Que eso se oye, aunque no salga, pero todo se oye ahí. Mejor apagarlo, después hoy no puedes aguantar unos 10 minutos. Vaya, vaya. Ok, Apagado. no los he silenciado porque quiero escuchar su participación, pero si hay ruido ahí en su sí. entorno, póngale usted mismo silencio. Ok. Ahí me está yes. reclamando, a ver cómo oyen y yo después no oyen mi voz. <risa> next. Ok, next. Chef. Um, <risa> Chef. <risa> 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 Yes, it's, it's a panadero, baker. Baker, panadero. This is, is to make a variety of breads and pastries. It's a baker. All right, let's continue. Baker. Vendor, vendor. Vendor. Butcher. 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 Carnicero. Yes. Ajá. That's butcher. Carnicero. Prepara la carne para la venta. Él es un carnicero. Butcher. Butcher. Yes, butcher. New vocabulary. Take notes of new vocabulary. Butcher. That's vocabulary for you. Butcher. Important. Okay. Butcher. Mechanic. 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 Yes. Car mechanic. Car mechanic. Car mechanic. Car mechanic. Carpenter. And designer. Oh, car yes. Carpenter. <laughs> Right on time. <coughs> oh, music. Um, yeah. Singer. Singer. Music. Music. Oh, oh, musician. Musician. Um, musician. 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 Singer. 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 Yeah, singer. Yes. <laughs> 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 Police officer. officer. Yeah, she looks out yeah, for yeah. the safety, for the safety of a community. All right. Keywords. Jardinero, oh, no, granjero, jardinero, granjero, farmer, farmer, yeah, farmer, yeah, ese es el granjero, farmer, 
Farmer. <coughs> Cartero. Carter. Carter. Cartero. Did it? Postman. 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 Oh, driver. 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 <laughs> okay, driver, but more specific. Driver. Driver. Uh -huh. Ahí dice, él maneja camiones, entonces es Camionero. un truck driver. Ajá, motorista de camión. Y así es de bus, bus driver. Taxi, taxi driver. Sí, driver. Okay, bus driver, taxi driver, truck driver. Driver, etc. Okay. okay, finish. <laughs> How many new words did you learn? ¿Cuántas palabras nuevas aprendieron? Uh, water. More. Too much. Okay. Too many. Una. Era Too many. Water. Too many. Okay. A lot of new vocabulary. You have to, to learn that vocabulary, right? Vamos a aprender ese vocabulario, okay? Okay. Eh, esta presentación se la voy a mandar mañana, a más tardar en, en la tarde antes de la clase. Okay? So don't worry for that. Um, pero la revisan, toman nota, hay que chequear vocabulario. Okay. 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 Vamos a ver. Okay. This is what we had in the platform, right? Eso es lo que estaba en la plataforma acerca de las profesiones. Okay. Okay, we have this uh, short exercise. Who work in these places? Complete the chart. Um, and you have to add one more job to each list. Tienen que agregar uno más a cada lista. Van a, a leer acá, sí. Van a leer. Aquí tienen en un hospital. ¿Quiénes trabajan en un hospital? A doc, uh, well, doctor, nurse, ¿qué más? Anesthesista. Ok. Recepcionista. Ajá. Uh -huh. They need a receptionist. Ok. Tienen que agregar una más. Escribir. Uh, dos de acá, escribir una más. ¿Sí? Ok. Yeah. Van a agregar dos de la lista y una más que ustedes puedan agregar de su vocabulario previo. ¿sí? Solo pongan en su cuaderno in a hospital y tres. In a office, tres. In a store, pongan tres. In a hotel, tres. Pueden chequear los de la lista previa, la, la que vimos al principio, que es la que está en la plataforma. Uh -huh. Ajá. Yeah, leche, leche que están hablando ahí.
Accounts. doing have you finished Finish. okay a uh, volunteer who work in a hospital doctor doctor nurse, doctor? nurse? nurse? security guard oh security guard yes security anesthetist dentist okay a dentist uh-huh yeah. okay a uh, volunteer who can tell me what do you have? Who work in an office? Secretary. Okay. Okay. Boss. Assistant. Assistant. Cashier. Cashier. Customer service manager. Managers, customer service agents. Okay. What about a store? Okay, front desk clerk, okay. In a store? Cashier. Sales, sales person. Mm -hmm. Sales person. Cashier. Security. Cashier, security. Roxana? In a hotel. Manager. Manager? Chef. Receptionist. Where? Receptionist. Bell shop. Bell shop. Bell shop. Bell shop. Bell shop. Okay. Bell shop. White taxi driver. Where? Uh, yeah, taxi drivers too. Security. Security guards. Okay, security guards. Yeah. Okay, well done. Okay, let's see. What do we have here? Okay, let's answer, ask and answer who questions about jobs. Uh-huh, use these words. Who wears a uniform? Uh -huh. well, who stands well, all day? Stands all day, is that clear? Stands all day? Uh -huh. Alguien que está parado o permanece parado todo el día? Carpenters. Carpenters. Electrician. No, no, no. Okay, electrician. Vendors, yes. Policeman. Policeman, okay. Passman. Okay. All right. Who sits all day? Who sits all day? Doctor. Um, nurse. Nurse, yeah. Doctor. Receptionist. Doctor. Receptionist. Yes. Secretary. Yes, secretary, yeah. Talent person. Talent person. Okay. Uh, who handles money? Who handles money? Cashier. Cashier. Okay. A cashier. Um, cashier. ¿Cómo, cómo se les dice a los que están en el banco? Cajero. Cashier. <laughs> No, if it is in a bank, si es en el banco, se le llama bank teller. Bank teller. Bank teller. Uh -huh. 
Okay, bank teller sit all day. Uh -huh. What else can you add? Okay, who talks to people? Who talks to people? Mm. Uh, vendor. Person, vendor. Customer service. Customer service agent. A teacher. A teacher, yes. Uh, <laughs> a lawyer. A lawyer. Okay, who works at night? Hmm. A doctor, doctor. A, doctor. <laughs> a doctor, manager, security, security guard, uh, taxi driver, taxi driver, no. taxi driver yes, and a police officer, a police officer, yes, <laughs> who works hard? And car mechanic. A car mechanic. Truck driver. A truck driver. Yeah. A postman. A postman. Yes, a postman. Yeah. A it's a very hard work. A chef. Yes, it's hard and stressful sometimes. Okay. Who makes a lot of money? Who makes a lot of money? Uh, politicians. <laughs> yes. <laughs> lawyer. 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 President. The president. Doctor. Ah, gaga. Character. A lot of money. Okay. No. <laughs> okay, good. Um, well, then we have a conversation. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm going to play the audio. So, can you see the picture? Um, well, I'm going to move this so you can see the picture. Okay, can you see the picture? Yeah. We have two two ladies. They are speaking. Uh, what do you think? Um, okay. What, what do you think? Okay. 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 What do you think about him? What is his occupation? Receptionist. Uh, well, a front desk clerk. Uh huh. He is, is a, a front desk clerk? advisor. Advisor. An advisor, probably. Oh, wow, mm -hmm. a triple advisor. Yeah, can be. Oh, sure. Uh, and that boy. The front desk clerk. Manager. Probably he's the manager. Is he? Does he look like a nice person? <laughs> no. Mm. No. <laughs> Does he look happy? No. 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 What does he look like? Angry. Mm, probably he's angry. And he's most likely a, a customer or a guest. All right. Let's listen to the conversation to discover what happened in the picture, right? gonna listen and then we check for vocabulary or if you have any question you can page 51 exercise 3 conversation he works in a hotel listen and practice where does your brother work in a hotel oh really my brother works in a hotel too he's a front desk clerk how does he like it he hates it he doesn't like the manager that's too bad. What hotel does he work for? The Plaza. That's funny. My brother works there too. Oh, that's interesting. What does he do? Actually, he's the manager. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> 
Mm, okay. Sounds like someone is in trouble. <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay. Do you have any question about vocabulary? Haitus. He haitus. Oh, hate. hate. Okay, hate. the verb is hate. Odiar. Odiar. Odiar, uh -huh. he And hate. lo odia. He hates it. He hates. <coughs> oh. Yes. What is the meaning desk clerk and clerk? Uh, uh, front, front desk clerk is like him, it's como un recepcionista. Uh -huh. Front desk clerk. Front desk clerk. Yes. Any other question? Que dijo que significaba from dress Clerk? Recepcionista, yeah. From this clerk. Yes. Es como un recepcionista. From this clerk. It's odiar. Mm -hmm. Any other question? Okay, let's listen to the conversation one more time. Page 51, exercise three, conversation. <coughs> he worked in a hotel. Listen and practice. Where does your brother work? In a hotel. Oh, really? My brother works in a hotel too. He's a front desk clerk. How does he like it? He hates it. He doesn't like the manager. That's too bad. What hotel does he work for? The plaza. That's funny. My brother works there too. Oh, that's interesting. What does he do? Actually, he's the manager. Okay. <laughs> A word that is very confusing is actually, because we think in Spanish it's like actualmente. Pero no, no significa actualmente. Es como decir en realidad. En realidad, él es, o, o a decir verdad. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. Sí, nos confundimos porque pensamos en español, decimos, ah, actually es actualmente. Well, no, no, actually is not actualmente, es como en realidad, o a decir verdad. ¿Y really? ¿Really? ¿Really? Yeah. Es, es una expresión como decir, oh, en realidad, o oh, sí. Yeah, in serio? Okay. Okay. Let's do this exercise. Todos los chicos van a repetir la parte de Angela. Y todas las chicas, Rachel. Okay. At the count of three. One, two, three. Where does your brother work? No, okay. In hotel. ¿Dónde está oh, el chico? Really? My brother, no, brother works in hotel work. No, 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 Si veo los participantes, a mí me parece que hay un montón de chicos, pero... <laughs> ok, empecemos otra vez. Girls, mm. Rachel, boys, Angela. One, two, three. Where does your brother work? Brother work? In a hotel. Oh, really? Oh, really? Oh, really? My brother no. works in a hotel. He is a front dress clerk. How does he like it? He hates it. He hates it. He doesn't like the manager. He doesn't like to. That's too bad. He doesn't like the manager. The manager. The plaza. That's funny. My brother works there too. Oh, oh, that, oh, that, oh that's, that's interesting. That's what does he do? He's the manager. Okay, pretty good, pretty good. Let's see, the word interesting. Interest. Interesting. 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 Uh -huh. Pronunciation. It's kind of difficult, right? But it's possible. Interesting. 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 
interesting. Interesting. Okay. Interesting. 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 There you have it. There you got it. You got it. Interesting. Uh -huh. Interesting. Okay. Interesting. Well, if you see, we discussed a little bit about a simple present. Uh, vimos un poco del presente simple, verdad? En el, tal vez lo vieron en el básico uno. Um, we're going to study that and we're going to make a, a, a review of, uh, well, questions. In this, um, we're going to work with questions, but before that, I would like to make a review. Let's remember that. Okay, here we go. Okay, in this part of the platform, we're going to start working with the Presente simple en WH Questions. Hello. Okay. Hello. Hello. Yes, hello. we can hear you. Hello, hello. Hello, we hello. can hear you. <laughs> Who's there? Quien es? <laughs> I'm Victor. Wow, Victor. <laughs> <laughs> Yes. Ok, por fin pudo conectar, ¿verdad? Como una semana con yes, ese yes. preso, Víctor. Por favor, mi Ok, it's great to hear you. Let's see. Well, this is a, like, como un review del presente simple, solo para recordar un poco las reglas. Decimos que lo formamos con el infinitivo del verbo. Pero en la tercera persona, cuando estamos haciendo oraciones afirmativas, en la mayoría de los verbos, va a tomar S el verbo, ¿verdad? Por ejemplo, si la persona es I, o sea, yo, I work. Yo trabajo. Tú trabajas, you work. O ustedes trabajan, igual, you work. As tú significa, eh, you significa tú y ustedes. We work and you work. Pero si se fijan en la tercera persona, al verbo le estamos agregando S, ¿verdad? He works. Yeah. Igual yeah. que en la conversación decía, he works in a hotel. Él trabaja en un hotel. He works in a hotel. She works. It works. He works. Ok. He Esto was solo... working in a hotel. Ajá. Uh -huh. Esto solo va a suceder cuando estemos haciendo oraciones afirmativas. Tercera persona singular, ¿verdad? Ok. Las reglas nos dicen que en general uh, vamos a tener en cuenta que a todos los verbos le vamos a agregar ese, ¿verdad? A la mayoría, a la gran mayoría, pero hay excepciones. Si caen en esas excepciones, por ejemplo, los verbos que terminan en, en Y. Ese, en ese. Por ejemplo, play no pasa nada, solo le agregamos S. Pero si se fijan, study, study ha cambiado acá. ¿Por qué? Veamos, si el verbo termina en Y, pero antes de la Y tengo una vocal, no pasa nada, solo le agrego S a la tercera persona singular, ¿verdad? Pero si antes de la Y hay una consonante, entonces voy a, a cambiar la Y por I latina y voy a agregar E, S. Es, es, es. Uh -huh. Recordando que solo sucede en la tercera persona singular oración afirmativa, ¿verdad? Si es eh, primera, segunda o plurales, no hacemos este cambio. Pero si estoy haciendo oración afirmativa, y hablo de una tercera persona singular, por eso decimos singular, entonces sí voy a agregar esos cambios. Por ejemplo, si quiero decir que um, mi papá lee el periódico, my father reads the newspaper. Okay. Okay. Ahora, la otra regla dice que si los verbos terminan en o, SH, TCH, X, SS, le vamos a agregar ES al verbo. Por ejemplo, si se fijan, go termina en O. 
Entonces, en tercera persona diría, he goes, she goes, it goes. It goes. Uh -huh. um, then we have another example. Uh, los que terminan en SH como wash. En tercera persona será washes. He washes, she washes, it washes. En right? TCH como watch. Watches. Se le agrega ES. Si terminan en X, como por ejemplo fix. Fixes. Doble S, como por ejemplo kiss. Kisses. Kisses. Ok. So, el presente simple es lo que usamos para hablar de actividades que hacemos usualmente, como trabajar, comer, eh, estudiar, eh, caminar, tomar el bus. Uh, usualmente... En el presente simple también podemos usar adverbios de frecuencia, como decir always, siempre, usually, usualmente. Sale, like that. Sin okay. apretarles. ¿Cómo va a salir? Que de ahí? Allí sale. De aquí para allá. No puede hablar de ahí. Hola. Hello. Hello. Okay, this is the first part with sentences, right? Now, in this part, well, interrogative and short answers. Para preguntas y de respuesta corta, Decimos, utilizamos do como auxiliar, ¿verdad? Auxiliar. Pero en la tercera persona vamos a usar das. Ajá. Por ejemplo, do you swim? You. El do lo vamos a usar con I, you, we, and they. Con el, el otro, con das, va a ser con la ¿Sí? ter ¿Sí? tercera persona singular, ¿verdad? Será das he, das she, das it. ¿Ok? Ok. Ahora con los demás ejemplos para que los puedan ver allá. Ok. Si se dan cuenta, siempre van a utilizar el auxiliar cuando responden también, cuando es uh, short answer, de respuesta corta. Estas son las famosas yes, no questions. Preguntas, sí o no. La respuesta puede ser sí o no. Do you swim? Yes, I do. O no, I don't. Yo no, no sabe los ejemplos. ¿No ven los ejemplos? ¿Los demás? No. No, no se mira. No, solo la primera. Es que no la puedo habilitar. Que sea. Pero sin, sin por... no, la primera diapositiva aparece. Sin por press. No, de press en simple tú. Solo aparece la primera diapositiva. Ah, sí. Ok, vamos, voy a, a, a volver a ponerla para compartir la pantalla, a ver si. Ok, creo que era esta, la dos, ok. Ok, ¿ahorita? Mm, no. Solo se ve la primera. Uh -huh. Ay, ¿qué pasó entonces? ¿Y ahora? Se tiene que habilitar. Dele es que habilitar edición. Creo que tiene vista protegida. O pónganla en iconito para verlo, no, está tan grande. Ok, ahorita dejé de compartir. ¿Sí la ven? No. 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 Bueno, le voy a dar compartir otra vez y voy a buscarla desde donde estaba. 
Ok, aquí ven la primera, ¿verdad? Un señor sí. rodeado de... Oh, oh, sí, ya, hoy sí, sí ahora sí. sí. Hoy sí, ok. Qué bueno que lo resolvimos, ya me estaba estresando. Ok. Interrogative and short answers. Esto era lo que les estaba diciendo. Esto es lo que les decía. Las preguntas cuya respuesta puede ser sí o no van a iniciar con el auxiliar. Si es primera, segunda o plural, va a ser tú. Luego van a poner el sujeto y luego el, eh, el verbo y probablemente podamos agregar un complemento, como si yo quisiera saber específicamente si usted nada los domingos. Do you swim on Sundays? Uh -huh. Yes, I do. Yes, I do o no, I don't. Siempre vamos a usar el auxiliar en las respuestas. Interrogative and short answers. Cuando sea tercera persona singular. Mm, das. 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 Esto quiere decir does he, does she, does it. Y si se fijan, no le hemos agregado la S al verbo. Porque eso solo se hace en oración afirmativa. Porque en afirmativa no tengo un auxiliar que me indique tercera persona. En cambio, en la, en la pregunta y en la oración negativa, sí, utilizo el auxiliar específico para tercera persona, que es das. Entonces, ya no necesito cambiar el verbo. El verbo solo se cambia, repito, en oración afirmativa. Lo de la S, S y todo eso. Okay. Okay. That's like a review. Este es como un repaso porque, bueno, vamos bien con los, con los temas. Y este tema es, tiene bastantes reglas, hay que, hay que comprenderlo, hay que practicarlo bastante, porque difícilmente que nos vamos a ponernos a memorizar todas esas reglas por ahí sentaditos en un pupitre, en un lugar aparte, ¿vea? Entonces es más fácil practicando, práctica, práctica, práctica. Uh -huh. Do you have any questions? ¿Tienen alguna pregunta? Teacher. Yes. Y cuando es ter, eh, tercera persona negativa en negación, no cambia el verbo o cómo es ahí. No, no cambia. Lo que les explicaba. Vaya. Vamos a hacer unos ejemplos acá. Eh, texto. Ahí me tienen paciencia porque soy muy lenta en typing. Por ejemplo, podemos decir um, my, my father. Él es tercera persona, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Puedo decir, my father works in a hotel. Vaya, mi papá trabaja en un hotel. My father works in a hotel. Le agregué la S al verbo, ¿verdad? Pero uh -huh. si yo digo, mi padre no trabaja en un hotel, sería my father doesn't, doesn't work. Y se mantiene work. Work. Ya no le pongo la S. Porque estoy utilizando el auxiliar de tercera persona. In a hotel. Mi padre no trabaja en un hotel. Ahora, la quiero convertir a pregunta. Does my father work in a hotel? Does my father work sin S? Así funciona esto. Es solo con la tercera persona singular. Uh -huh. eh, ¿Le respondí con eso? ¿Ya sí, no sí, tiene sí. duda? Ok, perfecto. Muchas gracias. Ok, les voy a mandar las presentaciones. Se nos terminó el tiempo. Me tengo que conectar a otra clase. Pero les voy a mandar las presentaciones y el día de mañana vamos a practicar. Lo vamos a poner en práctica. Vamos a seguir con el tema porque nos falta también la WH question, que es otro tipo de preguntas. Ok. 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 Thank you Thank for joining today's Thank class. You. Thank you. Good night. Sleep well. Enjoy your dinner. Bye bye.
Bye. See you tomorrow. Bye. See you tomorrow. Bye.